There's been an awful lot of talk at 155 pounds. Round MMA action. One. We'll see Kane Stray take on Jurgen Skruin. Stray 1-0 in boxing, making his MMA debut. Skruin taking out Roland Belov at the last Supreme Championships event is 1-0. It's an international. Skruin from the Fight Lab in Norway. Kane Stray oh. from Poole. Nice head kick from Kane. Skruin promoting that to take the takedown here. Nice knee. Beautiful work. Oh! Stray promised in this fight that Skruin would not want to continue competing afterwards, but Skruin getting that pickup is a tough physical dude. Stray wanted to strike, and again, cracks him with the right hand. The Stray was very focused coming into this fight, very confident as well at the weigh-ins. And rightly so, he's already hurt Screwing with that head kick. Now Screwing's in the mounted position here, Chris. This is dangerous for Stray. Yeah, it's a total contrast in strategies. Look at this, though. Triangle attempt here. Oh, he's secured the figure four. He's just going to turn the angle now and squeeze the knees together, Chris. Screwing looking for the submission finish here against Kane Stray. These guys promised to scrap. That is exactly what we've got here. Stray's going to try and get the posture. Screwing looking for the armbar now. He's got the leverage on the inside of the hip there, and he's forcing it down. He's going for that straight oh. armbar out of the triangle, Dean, like you said. My goodness. Stray has been submitted, I believe, a technical submission finish. Incredible performance. These guys were talking an awful lot of smack. I mean, there was talk of DMs. There was talk of what they were going to do to each other. It all came down to this. One of the quickest fights of the night so far. It looked like the arm popped, but he, he's, he's complaining of the right leg here, potentially the ankle. See, take a look at the replay to see the arm look like it popped, but he's complaining more of the ankle. And that, the, yeah, I was going to say that was my assessment of a technical submission. It looked like something had happened to force the referee to step in. Here's how it went down. Screw now. He was up against the cage here, and he accepted the bottom position. There was the initial takedown into side control. It's a great scramble work from Stray. Here was the exchange. Screw takes the ground here. And that was a nice left hand, actually, from Kane Stray. I mean, he talked about the strike and being one of the biggest advantages for him, but this was the end. Yeah, there was the triangle. But he, he tapped to the arm bar, so you can see here, he manipulates it. He doesn't use the hips, he uses his own leg. In this case, the left leg of Skruin as a pivot point, and he forces the hip down. But watch the arm here of Stray. Pop! Looked like there was a little pop there. And also, I think, a, a lack of oxygen as well for Kane. I mean, that's a miserable place to be. And Maddox having a look here. Looking like Strace definitely injured that right ankle. It's good to see if there's some swelling there on that side. Well, team, we've seen a lot of great skills from the Fight Lab guys. I mean, Ula Hatleflat coming up, we've mentioned him a couple of times. He's a man of few words. Ah, I got the chance to talk to these guys from the gym in Norway. Head this coach Matt Turner there in the corner. I mean, they're putting them work in the middle of snowstorms in a country where MMA is underrepresented at best. Yeah, it's legal there. They, I mean, Scrum was saying they started at Fight Lab after a rec recommendation from Hetlerflat. So definitely training together and um, in the right place. But he was wobbled early on with that head kick. Straight did a great job of firing that left Ladies head kick. And gentlemen, a Kyle Greaves has the result. Ends this bout in one minute and 17 seconds of the opening round. Don't let it by your winner in the red corner, Jurgen Schroeder.